Hello and welcome to the Brit Freaks. Today, finally, you're waiting for my final thoughts about this buggy here. You've seen the close ups and you see the shortly, I know, I know, too short driving sequence. I tell you later why. I tell you later why. But I'm so sorry about this. Okay, here's the instructions. Model number is 18002, the Green Hound Buggy. It's a stolen mock. In the description you find two links. One goes to the set from my supplier and the other goes to the original instructions on Rebricklink, uh, Rebrickable. Where you can buy original instructions for 20 bucks around. And so all are happy, you are happy, the designer is happy, Mold King is happy. Okay, I hope you've seen the assembly of this thing. If not, it's worth, it's really worth an assembly video to watch it, because this is a really cool car. We have nearly 2,000 pieces, and uh, this is steerable wire 2.4 gigahertz remote control, and wire a Bluetooth app, you find the link here. And this app, uh, with this car it works. It works not every, every time with every car from Old King, but with this model it works. You've seen I, stick a, I don't use the stickers, because I will sell it. And I do it with a broken heart. I do it with a broken heart, but I don't have the space. The stickers are absolutely okay from the quality I know from Old King. They are good, really, really good. I don't stick at it because I will sell it and the new buyer uh, should have the possibility to stick it herself or leave it. So, okay. But I will. I have to say this car looks much cooler when it's stickered. Absolutely. This will look really gorgeous when it's stickered. So, okay, you know. The assembly of this thing is pure fun. Really, really cool building techniques. I've never seen such ideas. Okay, I've never built a buggy, uh, but I've never seen such ideas. I built a lot of technic cars. Okay, mostly sport cars. Uh, uh, but that's that's really fun. It's cool. We have four engines for each wheel, and the fifth to steering. These are the new Mold King Black Furious motors and they have a little bit more power. I believe they are a little bit faster and have a little bit more torque. You know what I mean? Newton, made, Newton meter. Uh, so they are better than the older ones. But the battery box is not capable longer than 10-12 minutes to give this monster here, the power it needs, the four motors. The original design has two bubits, so it has two battery boxes and then it's better. You have one battery box for front wheels and one for the, the rear wheels. Um, I don't know how the original is assembled and how it's wired, but here with the remote you have the po normally with the normal street cars you have the possibility of um, two gears. A is one motor, here it's two, and B is the other motor or the other two in this case. In the C63 from AMG it's front and rear and always on the axle and not on the, the, the wheel itself. And I believe in the original design A are the both front wheels and B are the back the two back wheels. So if I here A is front right and left back and B is front left and rear right and this doesn't work. That doesn't work. But in the turbo mode when I switch turbo mode, here is a button. Then all engines are going. And you see, and this is 
this car has really power. Not for a long time, like a um, like a tiger for 800 meters, and then it's gone. Uh, so keep that in mind. If your child wants to play, or you, the whole afternoon with this thing, no way. Okay, so you know this. But the 10, 12 minutes you have, they are fun. This car is great. You've seen the intro, first the pictures and then the driving scenes. So the two short driving scenes, I know. I want to show you much, much more, because we did a lot of more. But there are two reasons I can't show you more. And one is a pity and one is really annoying for me. Or uh, Okay, first I was um, at the beach, because this is a beach buggy or a desert buggy. And I drove there 10, 12 minutes till the juice was gone. And my daughter didn't record. She thought she was recording, but she wasn't recording. Okay, no problem. Go home. Then I go load it, uh, give it juice, go into the park with my wife and give my wife the camera. And we did these two driving scenes, the short ones, and I want to record a lot of more, but then the SD card was full. Man! Okay, got home again. Go to a shop bought something, came home three hours later and I plugged it into my... I have a shelf there with a lot of micro USB and charging cables. Put it in, let it stay there, two meters this way. Came home, there was only one child at home for my two daughters and it standed here and the servo motor doesn't go. So you see it's driving, but no steering. I don't know what happened. You know how it is? Normally they are both at home when something is distracted and each say I didn't was it and I don't know which of the two child. <laughs> this time I know it could be only the, the smaller one uh, but it's, it's like it is with child. They don't, mostly they don't say I did it. So I'm a little bit disappointed that she doesn't say she, I believe she wants to charge her smartphone and this felt down and landed, I don't know how, and the servo is gone. Okay, I ordered a new one, but it will take two weeks. But I have to disassemble the whole car and assemble it new. So, okay, it is what it is. The quality of the bricks here, it's Mold King buys their pieces from uh, Gobrix, or at least I don't know where they buy their electronic, but the, non, the normal pieces are from Gobrix, and this is the best Chinese manufacturer. This is nearly on Lego niveau. It's nearly ne Lego with 99%. If you have closed eyes, you didn't feel, you don't feel the difference. There are some parts but 99% you don't feel a difference, everything works fine, everything works fine. The engines has, on the motor have really, really power, the, the app works, this works. So this is a really good deal for the money, because five motors, the box, the RC, you know what this will cost from LEGO, you know the 4200, no, 099. The orange buggy or crawler, 4x4 crawler from beginning of this year. Man, or end of last year? I don't know. End of last year. This was a disappointment. It was so slow. Of course, it's meant to be slow as a crawler. But 230 euros 
here in Germany and I believe it will be $230 or $220 at least. What you get and a K less pieces than this here. So this is a good, good deal. This thing is fast, it's perfectly, you see this, the wishbones are making a great job. It's very cool to assemble, makes a lot of fun assembling it, makes more fun driving it. And the only thing I could say is really that the battery box is not, not big enough from, from, from the power in it. So 10-12 minutes. And you have to know that the servo from all Chinese companies don't have 15 stands like the Lego. This here has full left, nothing full right. Nothing in between. It's totally digital. Normally this sucks sometimes because it's not easy to drive with always full. But this thing here is so fast and so much fun and can drive nearly over everything. So <laughs> for that car it doesn't bother me as much as with other cars that the servo has only these three points, total left, nothing and total right. But if you buy this and you think, okay, the servo sucks, just build in the Lego one, it's compatible with the box, so everything is all right, no problem with that. If you want to buy this after this video, just watch the assemble video, to be sure. But like I said, this thing is cool. And the, the joints, they are normally from plastic. You know, the normal joints in every RC car or every car from Lego, they're always the same. And normally you have the, the Chinese one, you have to assemble itself. But here it's pre-assembled steel joints for all the force that is here on our front with power and steering on the front axle. So axle, so okay steel. And the two, um, I believe it's eight length, there are two carbon fiber axes here. And they are not for the power, they are for the steering. The steering mechanism here is very unique. I haven't built anything like that. And if, is it not necessary to build this way? I don't know. But it's complex and it's different. And it, I'm sure you need a little bit more power. And so they um, built in here the carbon fiber axles. So this, this set in my eyes is absolutely great. You pay $130 with worldwide shipping. You get a really great car. For $20 you get original instructions, so it's $150. For five more doors, the battery box, the RC, app compatibility, really good, great quality, cool design car. A perfect deal. A perfect deal. Okay, if you have any questions, just write me in the comments. I believe I said everything to you. You know, length, height, weight. You know it's driving good. I say it's driving good. You see it's a short video of driving it. You see how fast it is. It's really fast. It's great. This is great. Okay, that's all I have to say. It's great. It's great. Okay, uh, that was it. I had a good time, and if you want to have a good time, get it. Okay, I'm Frank from the Brick Fix. Have a good time. I hope in the near future I, I can show you a shaved face like I normally are, but I have a bed with my daughter. She's not using makeup, and I'm not shaving and we are waiting which one can take it longer and in the beginning I believe two days and then she will use makeup she's 14 but it's nearly six seven eight weeks now and she didn't use makeup so I didn't shave and that's why I'm looking like Eric the Viking 
sorry for that. Okay, have a good time. Bye-bye.